everyone, welcome to Body Life Crochet. I just wanted to share with you guys how I make affordable and just simple stitch markers. I like to use these lobster clamps. They're really easy to open and I like how big the opening is so I'm not trying to jam it into my work. And then you can personalize it by using any charms you'd like. I got both of these from Joann's and let's see, I have the receipt right here so I can tell you how much they were. Um, the stones were about $7 and the clamps were $3.49. So if you use one of their 40% off coupons, it's really not that bad. And um, yeah, you get to personalize your own stitch markers. You could make these as a gift for a fellow yarn lover. And so let's get into it and I'll show you how I make them. Okay, so here's one that's finished. It's fairly simple. You just need a pair of pliers and your little jewels here and your lobster clamp. I'm using my husband's um, Gerber multi-tool. So let's see, I made a red one. Let's pick a contrasting color. We'll do blue next. And these come very well secured in their packaging. <laughs> Let me pull that out. And these ones already come with the circles on them that we need. And you can see a little opening at the end of them. Let me find it. Right here. So what we're going to do is hold it on one side and take our multi-tool or our pliers. And we're going to open it. Spread it apart just a little bit. So it's open. We're going to take our lobster clamp and insert it into the opening. Now take this part slowly so you're not dropping your charm or the lobster clamp. And I would take your tool again and just push it back where it was before. And then you can kind of squish that circle together to really close it all the way. And there you have it, there's your stitch marker. So I know it seems super simple. I just never really thought about making my own before until one day I just had the resources and I thought it would be cute. So um, I'm going to make the rest of these and just have my own little set of colorful stitch markers. Here's my original stitch marker. This just came about one day. I just so happened to have this in my craft box and I bought this to make a necklace and the necklace didn't turn out. So I thought I'll just make a stitch marker. And I really love this extra big lobster clamp for my chunky yarn. And this one opens very, very easily. So really you can personalize them any way you'd like. I think it's really fun. And I hope you enjoyed this tutorial today. If you did, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more crochet tips, tricks, and free patterns. Happy crocheting.